an openly gay high school student is speaking out after he says he's been verbally abused and harassed by his classmates. The student is a junior at Knoxville High School. He was recently suspended for two days for starting a fight with a fellow female student. He says she repeatedly made hateful comments about his sexuality. Channel 5 Eyewitness News reporter Brian Armantrout spoke with him today. He's live with that story. Brian? Well, Chris, 17-year-old John Herway has chosen to not talk about that most recent encounter you just heard about, but he will tell you it's tough enough being a high school student, let alone being gay. John Herway, for the most part, is your typical teen who spends a lot of his free time talking with friends on the phone. But Herway is also part of the minority. It's, it's very hard being gay in high school. It really is. It's Herway, now a junior, moved to Knoxville his freshman year, at which point he made his sexuality known. At the time, he was the only openly gay student walking the halls here at Knoxville High. Now he's joined by more than a dozen others. We do like to put our sexuality out there, I guess, and... Uh, it's so, yes, it can cause up some problems. He says most of his fellow classmates and teachers are okay with it, but the ones who are not okay with it make her way's toughest years even okay. more unbearable. At first, I guess you just seem to build a block around it. You just ignore it. But um, eventually, I, I am the type of person that likes to, you know, take care of it, make sure it gets solved by, you know, getting a teacher or getting somebody involved. One person who wasn't involved until recently is his mother. She didn't know her son is gay until a couple months ago. She says the news was a shock to her system, but she supports her son. Herway wishes everyone out there was like his mom, but he knows that's not possible. So I wish everybody could get along, but you can't keep everybody happy all the time. Yesterday I did speak with the school principal who says the harassment is a dead issue and would not comment beyond that. As for her way, he knows hitting that girl was a bad idea and knows you're wrong, Chris. All right, Brian, thanks a lot. Well, the Knoxville School District does have a policy against harassment. That policy states that harassment of students will not be tolerated. Harassment includes, but is not limited to, racial, religious, national origin, age, disability, and sexual harassment.